I'm Wish TV Storm Track A meteorologist Marcus Bailey looking ahead to a weekend. Hope you had a great work week. This is your overnight update here uh, for Friday the 13th of April 2018. Let's look ahead to your Saturday. Actually, let's look past that and uh, beyond your Friday. Afternoon highs were great. 79, officially your high in Indianapolis. Didn't quite make it to 80, but there were some of you that did. Muncie, Shelbyville, Columbus officially go down in the books today as 80 degrees. Most areas were dry. We did have a few isolated showers that made, made their way through portions of the area during the afternoon hours. We'll be tracking more rain and a few thunderstorms while many of you are sleeping overnight. So if you're watching this and waking up, I don't think we have any severe weather to deal with at least for the overnight hours leading into the morning drive, but or the uh, early morning hours of Saturday. Uh, could it have some potential for heavy rain? And again, a few garden variety thunderstorms possible. There is that severe weather risk. That's more so for the afternoon. Marginal risk across much of central Indiana with a heightened slight risk for our western counties. That will come after lunchtime. We think this first wave moves out by midday on Saturday. We catch a little bit of a lull. Could help recharge the atmosphere a bit. And then we'll get some isolated thunderstorms that we think could be on the strongest severe side. Damaging wind, the primary concern. Won't rule out a rogue tornado or maybe some hail. And certainly flooding is going to be an issue with some decent downpours here and there. Cold front's gone by very late Saturday night. So the window really for severe weather is I think going to be late afternoon to mid-evening here in central Indiana. And then it's going to be widespread, steady rain late Saturday night heading into Sunday. Numbers before the cold front moves out, 70. So another warm day on tap, even though we'll get all that rain. Most areas should be pretty close to that exception to that rule, maybe up north where you're only in the mid-60s. And then a very wet look, non-severe storms rolling in Sunday early morning from midnight to 6 a.m. That's a wet look continue that trend through midday and then we'll start to wind things down a little bit as we get closer to the evening hours but you're going to talk talking several hours here of some widespread heavy rain potentially to wrap up the weekend one to two inches i think is certainly possible across much of central indiana there could be some isolated higher amounts so a lot that we're going to have to watch for here uh, for the weekend. Unfortunately, it's going to mean a cool down to Chapman Heating and Cooling 8-day forecast. Uh, we'll go from the 70s to the 50s Saturday to Sunday and cold enough Monday morning I think we get a bit of a wintry mix sliding in here. Uh, maybe even just all snow. No accumulation expected. Chilly start Tuesday morning, upper 20s, but we bounce back to the 50s Tuesday. Back to above average with isolated rain chances Wednesday. Lots of ups and downs. We go back to 50 on Thursday and then we go back to near normal temperatures for Friday and Saturday of next week to wrap up the work week. Great time with the severe weather aspect in the cards for the weekend to have our Wish TV weather app, interactive radar, and of course weather alerts based on your location. That is a free download. Just go to your phone's app store and search for Wish TV weather. Stephanie Mead has you covered on the TV side for 24-hour News 8 Daybreak Saturday starting at 6 a.m. And of course updates 24 hours a day on our website wishtv.com. Have a safe overnight and a wonderful weekend.